So this question on vectors uh, requires us to go around the picture adding on everything we can about it. Uh, we recognize the parallelogram. So this tells me that this will also be 3B. Um, add these up, we get 3B. That side will also be 3B. Uh, they're telling us that um, B is the midpoint of this line here. So we now know that that is A as well. So therefore the whole of this must be 3A. And they're telling us that M is the midpoint of this line here. So if we work out what uh, E to B is, then that's going to be E to C plus C to B. Remember the resultant of um, going on any journey will be the same whichever direction you go on. So E to B is going to be from E to C and then C to B. So we've got 3B plus A. And they're telling us that um, M is the midpoint of that. So the arrow is going in that direction because we're doing E to B. And we know then that that is a half of 3B plus A. And this is also a half of 3B plus A. Um, so we've got our picture uh, labelled up. Now we can go through and decide what the question actually wants. So it wants um, to for you to show that AMD is a straight line. Now if that's true, then if I work out the vector A to M, and then I work out the vector A to D, and they're multiples of each other, then that'll be fine. So A to M is going to be the journey from A to B plus B to M. Well, A to B was negative A, B to M was negative um, a half of 3B plus A. Uh, when I work all that out, I end up with uh, negative so whole a take away half an a, so that's 3 over 2a, and then I've got uh, half times 3b, which is negative uh, 3 over 2b. So if I take out um, the common factor of uh, 3 over 2, then this is 3 over 2 of negative a take away b. So now I need to work out what uh, a to d is. So the journey a to d is going to be, well, a to d will be ac plus CD. Well, A to C we can see is negative 2A plus C to D is negative 2B, um, which factorises to uh, 2 of negative A, negative B. Okay, so what we can see straight away then is that vector and that vector are the same. So we can conclude that um, AD is a multiple of AM, therefore is parallel, and with a common point of A, then AMD must be a straight line. Okay, so we filled in um, the picture with all the vectors we knew. We then worked through what the question wanted. It wanted to prove that AMD is a straight line. So we went through and showed what A to M was. Uh, we showed what A to D was. Um, because AD was a multiple of AM, so they have the common vector of negative A, negative B, then they're parallel. And because they both started at A, then they must also be in a straight line. So that's how we can use vectors to prove whether things are in a straight line.